Once I met Orphans For Real, it went from conceptual, ideological, to experiential and relational. And I started thinking, what if I was born here? What if I was born in the slum in Kenya and there was nobody to help me? I really believe we're making a difference in the lives of the children we're supporting. Out of our abundance, it's just easier to love the children. This is our fifth annual charity event, and everybody loves it. Like, yeah. who doesn't want to celebrate, yeah. have a good time, get dressed up, yeah. have drinks, and yeah. enjoy? We all come together to help the children that are uh, benefiting from the program. I always wanted to give back to the community. Anything I can do to be a part of a great event like this. I started with myself in a vision, and tonight we had 25 volunteers. There's, I think, 160 people next door that donated a bunch of money. In Mexico, the government doesn't necessarily subsidize and help their orphanage and so they depend on private donation. Having these programs where volunteers can visit them, having one-on-one -on -one interaction, it enriches our lives. And this is something that's kind of like local. It's like happening 30 miles away from us. But because Mexico is literally an hour away, we can be relationally consistent. I can literally go to the orphanage, just play with the children that I'm helping support. I've been there physically, been with these babies, touched them, held them fed them, polished their fingernails. Uh, their parents have given them up or they've been taken from their parents because of abuse. I mean, these kids are just precious and they just want to be loved. But the unexpected joy that uh, everyone gets in seeing their happiness. Their identity with people that are consistently bringing love in Jesus' name. I've literally seen children come from babies to middle school, high school students and just that transformation um, from poverty has been a really cool impact. You don't have to just give your money and be like, oh, where's this going? You see it's going to feed this child and give this yeah. child a warmer blanket and keep more flies off their food. That God makes all these beautiful, amazing people that are generous, that are gifted in different ways, that want to be part of a team to fight the darkness. This community does what they do in Jesus' name. And you 4 is there doing the kingdom work every single day. It's kind of our call as Christians to take care of the widows and the orphans. Have you stepped into those dark places to give all you could to make this world a better place? You donate and you know that it's going We're to the organization. We are delivering kids from really difficult, vulnerable situations. These people are in need. They definitely are in need. It's important that children get solid education early on where they have a better opportunity in life. To help uh, bring light in the broken and dark places. It's all of our jobs to be there for the children. Giving them the ability to earn money to take care of their families. We're making an influence.